What's up people, Scopopo here and welcome back to another video of our city building experience or whatever you would like to call it. And since the last video I have done literally nothing because we are basically starting right after that video was finished and I think we'll just more or less continue from where we left off last time so this time i'm thinking of keeping in the theme of using quartz and some sort of wood and for this one i am thinking of going with a bit of an acacia look and we'll see where that leads us so I'll, i'm just going to get the layout done and the ideas out and then i'll check back with you then now we have the basic idea for this house which is kind of a smaller model which i enjoy it's good having some variety but as you can see this one plays a bit more with arches and circles than the others that were a bit more rugged and you could say normal looking but i want to give this roof a bit more um, character and depth because it feels kind of flat right now so I, I'll see what I can do about that and other than that it's just filling in the walls with tons and tons of glass and that should be the house done then and I think the solution to making the roof a bit more textured and detailed was simply just to add a ring of quartz accent around it just half a slab above not half a slab half a block above it sticking out from this stair right here this gives us some nice detail that i really really enjoy so now for the rest of the build and that about does it as i stated before this is a bit of a smaller build as you can see it's about a couple of blocks shorter than this one over here but it isn't quite as tall and it doesn't have two stories so as you can see it is quite small but i do enjoy that fact about it and i didn't mean to destroy that door there we are so it is more or less just a glass box some would maybe call it a greenhouse but i really dig the aesthetic of it and if you can't live in it well that's just what that is most of these are just meant to decorate this city so i think it turned out quite nice i like the arches and the curves and all of that next step would be to do a bit of gardening which i'm going to do right about now and there we are now it kind of looks like somebody lives here uh, maybe somebody who haven't mowed their lawn in a couple of years but someone might live there which lead, uh, leads us right over here where i'm going to build the next house which is also just going to be more or less the same style except this time i'm going to lean a bit more over to the modern aesthetic i think but we'll see where it leads us in just one second well it's about done and it looks kind of funky to say the least it is kind of unconventional i'm just going to call it that um i wouldn't say it's the prettiest of the houses but it adds something and i kind of really do dig it from this side it has some nice intrigue coming in from this side but this part over here is kind of wonky but I'm just going to leave it because I believe it gives some aesthetic to the building and I'm just going to add this thing over here just to give it a bit of consistency I would call it and yeah now I just need to put in a garden so 
just going to start with the hedge, which I haven't mentioned it, but this world I'm playing on also has world edit, which comes in handy quite frequently. So let's just go there. Oh, it didn't work because I haven't towered up. Give me a second. I need these bad boys right here. And one, two, three, four. Take this one. And maybe. Yeah, it it's two lines, so we do it over here and we should be good to go. Bam. Now we have a hedge and we can do the same for this side. And bam. Perfect. And now I can do a bit of gardening. There we are. Again, not my favorite house, but it does the job. And from this angle, it's pretty all right. So yeah, that is going to be more or less what we, what we have time for today. And as we can see, it is beginning to look alive now that we have four villas and a couple of other things scattered around. So yeah, hopefully you enjoyed If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. Maybe leave a comment if you have any ideas for what I could do to improve this. And I'll see you all next time.